This is an adventure of seven mates sailing on two 37-foot yachts to get to one of Australia's most pristine and remote islands. Sitting 500 kilometres offshore of the northern New South Wales coastline lies Lord Howe Island. This is the bowline apparently. Run you through it. Alright, rabbit comes up the hole, round the tree, back down. <laughs> That's not how you do a bowline. <laughs> She's all ready to go, all packed up. Um, we just smashed some brekkie now. Still the final prep work, and we're pretty much ready to go. Find the country day, right? <laughs> You've seen them stars from caught in a dream She's a total knockout but I'm still in the ring Nah, I ain't gonna lay low Get the crowd on the top with a halo I'ma give you those now, make you say whoa Got the treasure, you can call me the king Yeah, boy! 25 knots offshore, dusting probably around 30 So, full reef main um, Once we get to Middleton, we'll find somewhere to anchor And then to Lord Howe Island What you say, what you say How's the spirits over on that boat? Brunzi, over. We've got a couple of spills over here, but we're going alright. Yeah, fair enough. It's been a rough day. Start our first. Nice. Well, good to hear you guys are still kicking that and uh, safe journey through the night. Stay safe, boys! <laughs> <laughs> Take it easy, eh? <laughs> just sailing through the night here. We're just doing uh, three hour shifts at the moment. Yeah, it's been pretty loose. It's about as nice as we've had it. 15 knot winds and we're traveling at seven knots at the moment. Um, yeah, be 48 hours come the morning and we should be at Middleton Reef. And then we're expecting lighter winds tomorrow. So we'll be um, probably just putting the motor on and cruising from Middleton Reef to Lord Howe.
Yeah, g'day guys. <laughs> just about to kick off the fishing classic. Uh, we've just uh, exited the green zone here. So us young guns are gonna be versing uh, Shoshi Gaff, featured out on the horizon there as we make our way to Lord Howe Island. Whoever catches <laughs> the biggest fish today is the winner and the losing boat has to cook a meal for everyone when we arrive at Lord Howe Island. Ye beauty. They've called themselves Chelsea Gaff because we are gaffless. We have none on board. Yeah, young guns, Chelsea Gaff here. Uh, I've out of this marine park, so we're about to drop a line, mate. All over it, bring it on. We're going to drop him in now. Mitch's got a couple of words for you. Yeah, good luck, boys. Literally, two words. <laughs> yeah, that's it. That's the only two words. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, it's a bad body! So, I uh, was still struggling to come to terms with losing that dolly that we hooked on to. Uh, we got word from the other boat. They reckon they've hooked on to someone, but they're not going to let us know what, what it is. Until, until the way until, we, uh, until the way so we still got a bit of time taking out the fishing comp with the tuna. Yeah, it was a decent big old tuna. It was awesome sashimi. So we pull up next to him. They got a 1.3 meter. 1.4. 1.4. 1 1.4 meter. Wahoo, about 30 kilos. The thing was fat as. And uh, yeah, now we've got So anyway, fish. we've had to do the cooking. And uh, how did it go, boys? How good. Tasty. How good. How good. How good. How good. How good. <laughs> Here we are, Lord Howe. After four days of sailing, we finally made it. Yeah, brother. From the cruise control, we're gonna wet these wheels, baby. low pressure system down here up to 50 knot winds and we'll be feeling maybe five to six meter waves um, so we have to wait for that to pass have to pass and we'll be all right by probably Tuesday Monday Tuesday we'll be right so the trip just got extended by about a week <laughs> not too unhappy about that one 
stuck on an island for a week. <laughs> <laughs> Probably the last beer on Lord Howe Island. Just waiting for the peak of high tide and we'll be out of here. It's been epic. <laughs> Every day we've either been surfing or diving, exploring, riding, um, hiking. What was your favourite part? Oh man, I, yeah, I didn't really know what to expect coming here. The waves were epic, diving was unreal. Here's Skip. It's been one hell of a trip over to Lord Howe. Three day uh, rough sailing to get here. We've had a nice little week and a half and what's the go to get home? Yeah, so we got we don't have much wind to get home so we do, we're doing about three days of motor sailing. Um, and the swell's dropping so the conditions look pretty good for a motor sail. Um, towards the end of the trip we'll get a bit more wind and yeah, everything should be sweet. Just for everyone on the island pretty much. You're a yeah. bunch of legends. Yeah, cheers. Cheers.